Welcome. Let's understand 240 volt AC, 60 Hz, UPS sizing calculation. The purpose of this calculation is to size the UPS for substation application. UPS sizing calculation can be done based on the load requirements for different system connected to the 240 volt AC system for substation. Loads of UPS may covers. DCS Telecommunication system Operator or engineering workstation PCs Gateway PCs LCD TFT monitors Laser printers, A3 Dot matrix printer etc. The UPS system shall consist of a dual independently operating units sharing the load necessary for the reliable operation of UPS system under all operating conditions of the substation. UPS shall comprise, but not be limited to the following major items. 2 thyristor controlled, or GBT controlled 110 volt DC by 240 volt AC inverters. 2 static interrupter, and transfer switches. 1 240 by 240 volt, single phase isolating bypass transformer. 2 manual bypass switches. 1 UPS distribution board with control devices. The output power shall be designed to provide uninterrupted power supply for various loads and online monitoring systems, considering all actual loads, requirements for future expansion. 10% spare power requirements may be considered in calculation for all components fed from UPS. Or requirements may be considered as per client specifications. The UPS selection process involves several steps as discussed briefly here. Step 1, Calculation for Determine Load KVA. A to Determine Supervisory Control System, SCS. B to Determine Telecommunication System, TCS. C to Determine Security Management System, SMS, which includes CCTV, Access Control System etc. Step 2, Determining Load Power Factor. Considering power factor 0.8 for inductive loads. Step 3, load voltage, number of phases and frequency. Load voltage, equals 240 V. Number of phases, equals 1 phase. Frequency, equals 60 Hz. Supervisory control system, SCS, includes loads like. Server. Gateway. Firewall router. Ethernet switch. GPS. KVM and KVM switch. Operator desk. Telecommunication system, TCS, loads includes telecom equipments. Security management system, SMS, loads includes. Indoor and outdoor camera, workstation, LED monitor, media converter etc. Here considered system parameters are Nominal input voltage, AC equals 240 volt Nominal input voltage, DC equals 110 volt Output voltage, AC equals 240 volt Frequency equals 60 Hz Power factor equals 0.8 Efficiency equals 85% Let's see analysis of load connected to the battery Real power required by load equals 7500 watt. Efficiency of inverter equals 0.85. Input AC power required by inverter equals 8824 watts. Input DC power required by inverter equals 8824 watts. Therefore, the load to be delivered by the battery equals 8824 watts. UPS loads can be calculated as tabulated here, which includes various components, quantity of components, normal power of each component, diversity factor, spare margin, real power, power factor, apparent power, and reactive power. Now let's see selection of UPS. 
Actual apparent power required equals 9000, which is calculated based on above explained format. UPS capacity chosen equals 10,000 VA. Designed power factor of UPS equals 0.8. Real power equals 8,000 watts. Reactive power equals 6,000 VAR. From the above, it can be concluded that the rated power of UPS is 8,000 watts is greater than the required real power of UPS, load 7,500 watts and hence, the chosen UPS capacity is adequate. Static Bypass Switch Sizing Static Bypass Switch is also designed, for inverter capacity with the following overloading. 150% continuously. 200% for 10 minutes. 2000% for 20 millisecond. Overload capacity. Inverter is having following overloading capacity. 110% for 2 hours. 125% for 10 minutes. 150% for 10 SEC. 200% for 100 millisecond. Thank you for your attention and time. More stuff coming soon. Don't forget to subscribe.